Okay, so from last week's office hours, we had a question where uh, one of the customers asked if they have multiple audio tracks and they want to preview one of them, but run the algorithm on another one. How do, do they go about doing that? So I have this video here. It has two audio tracks. Um, audio track zero, one, and the combination zero and one. Uh, to prove to you, I've also loaded it up inside Premiere Pro. Like you go to my con See, there's one um, on one track. There's the music, and on the other track, there's the uh, the sound. So I want to run Time Vault on the first track, and on track two we have the music. So let's just go ahead and do that. And it's already done. So like zero, it runs it on this one. Um, but when I preview it, I want it to preview zero and one so that I can you know have both the audio tracks playing at the same time. So in order to do that, what I'll do is I'm going to save this audio track timeline. Okay, I'm going to save this timeline. So now I have a timeline which has these saved cuts. Now I'm going to go back into audio track 01. And as you can see, now it looks you're an engineer or like a combination of both of those tracks. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to apply the save timeline cuts from the previous timeline. So I'm going to click on this button right here, apply timeline cuts, select the JSON file and apply timeline. Let's see where the JSON file is. I saved it here under the name multiple audio tracks. It might not be obvious to you, but if I play this, do that, you make a playlist, right? You go to my content, select. These are the tracks from the previous timeline. So now you can edit the video uh, with the detections from the previous timeline.